Aid for AIDS of Nevada's annual AIDS Walk Las Vegas is back, and this year it has a whole new home base, the Las Vegas Ballpark. Here to tell us more about the event are Andrew Ryan, a fan marketing and events director, JT Sumalo, a performer at Vegas The Show, and they also brought Cassandra Vasilenko, another performer at Vegas The Show, and our model today. I mean, I, clearly everyone can see who's who <laughs> in this lineup this morning. I left my headpiece at home. <laughs> <laughs> right, it was fabulous. So, the, the AIDS Walk this year, tell us a little bit more about it. Yes, a, a fans AIDS Walk, we're back again. Can you believe it's already been a year? But I'm really excited to tell you guys that as of this morning, we are only a little less than $3,000 away from our big goal of raising $150,000. Wow, yay! Awesome. Yes. Good job. The it, community is showing up, and that it, it's so great. Uh, this walk is really a representation of just how much support that your organization has in this community. So how does the AFANS, the AFAN AIDS Walk, how does that help your organization? Yeah, well, you know, this year we're celebrating 40 years serving the Las Vegas community. And Aid for AIDS of Nevada is the largest and oldest HIV AIDS service organization in the state. And I want people to remember that every single dollar that they raise at any of our events throughout the year stays local. We are a locally funded agency. And it's really important because that money goes directly to our client services. That includes nutritional case management, housing, transportation, medical case management, and more. We do free testing in our office. We refer to community partners and work with them every single day. So there's a lot of work to be done. And there were over 500 and infections last year in our state alone. So it's still a problem and people aren't talking about it enough. So we're going to keep out in the community doing our advocacy work and making sure that we continue to share the information that we have with people and get that out into the community. But you guys are nearly at your target goal. Um, the, 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 the day itself is so much fun. It's more than just the walk. So who's performing? this year. We this year. are so excited about this year's entertainment lineup and of course our friends from Vegas the show. Right. Hey. That's one of my favorite shows. If you haven't seen it, go. But you get a little bit of a taste at our events of what the show's all about. Yeah. Uh, we're excited to team up. First of all, the weather is amazing, but we're also excited for Vegas the show to partner up with AFAN again and uh, just have such a great event. All the performers from the Strip uh, get to come together and really show what our community has for such a great event. Now, a lot of love, a lot of work goes into putting something like this together. So what is the most rewarding part once you've seen it all come together and you see people come out for this? I think it's that moment that, you know, we have a festival that's before the walk at 9 a.m. Uh, Check-in starts at 8, festival at 9, walk at 10. But it's that moment when you see the community, people from all walks of life coming together. It's pet friendly, so you can bring your dogs. It's a family friendly event. And you know, there's not a lot of those in Vegas necessarily. So it's an event that brings everyone together. We reflect back on 40 years of service. We see all those faces and know that we're there for a cause and making a difference in the community. I think that's the most important thing that we can do at these events. With so much preparation and build up to this, uh, obviously you're focused on making everything perfect, but what are you most excited about this year? And then you guys too afterwards. <laughs> apart, <laughs> apart from performing, what are you most excited to, to do or see? I'm really excited for our U equals U partnership. That's something that I, I'm always excited to talk about because Undetectable equals untransmittable. It's a message that we're trying to spread across the community so that people know that how important that messaging is. And it's not talked about enough. So our partnership with the Live Love campaign is going to be all over the walk this year. And we're really excited about that. And of course, I'm excited for the entertainment. Yeah, I mean, yeah. we've got our <laughs> cast from Chippendales coming out to support and do the pre-walk stretch. We've got Vegas to show. We've got cast members from... I think three or four other amazing shows, a couple surprises. We've got Sky D. Miles doing some incredible singing. Uh, I'm just so thrilled. And Jake Dupree, he's an incredible dancer and performer. He's going to be out there doing a special performance for us. Wonderful. JT, what are you most looking forward to? Well, AFAN knows how to throw an event and a party always. So for us, Vegas' show is just excited to showcase our talents outside of the theater as well because we love our show. And it's nice to be able to just really come into our own with um, such a great partnership. Is there, is there a, an ability for people to still sign up for the walk? Can people just go and spectate? Can they buy tickets? We want to encourage everyone to do two things. First of all, follow us on social media at AFANLV. And then head over to the website. It's free to register, but you can also donate when you register. And you can share. It's a peer-to-peer -peer fundraising platform. So you can share it on your social media, encourage your friends and family to donate. And you know what? We did set the goal. We're almost there. But you know what? Let's blow it out of the water this year and do even bigger, better things. Because that money, we're going to make it go so far 
and help all of our clients this year. Yes. Very cool. Thank you yeah. so much for joining us this morning. For more information on the 34th annual AIDS Walk, visit AFANLV.org.